you know, I guess you don't know. I'm sitting outside, getting ready to go in. And while I'm sitting here, many things are going through my thoughts because there's a lot of things I'm seeing that's unfolding, that everything points to a direction of a end of one phase and a beginning of another phase. And with this transition of time that I don't wanna really try to input time, but I wanna see the alignment of everything for what it is. So I've been looking into that kind of stuff, especially within the revelations and talking about a particular verse. I just did another video on it, but it talks about the Euphrates River and how it'll dry up and it'll be done in a way that the kings of the earth that are of the east, that they might be prepared, which means that this is furthermore a depiction about how everything unfolds in a way to you were told, you were warned, you knew in advance. Now what say you? You know, these are very judging times that we are in. They are troublesome, they are worrisome, but not if you know the truth about God, about life, and the unfolding of everything that's about to take place. For what happens from here are decisions that we have made. And everything plays a beautiful factor in a huge picture. But, so you gotta consider the Holy Bible, the book of Revelations, chapter 16, and in a spot, I want to say section 12. Talks about the preparation of the drying of the Euphrates River. So when you look up the Euphrates River and it drying up and it being at the level that it's at, and the timing of everything else that occurs when that occurs, then you got to consider the releasing of the loosening of the four beasts, and then what the four beasts are, and what they represent, and how everything is at this particular moment in time. Then you could have a glimpse about where we truly are with everything occurring. And then you might be somewhat more prepared for what's about to take place. For if you know the truth, then you know you're all right, because you know God. So with that in mind, I'm gonna say peace out for now. <laughs>